The A303 is a vital road between the southeast and the southwest of England. We're planning to greatly improve it as part of the government's promise to develop the whole of this long distance route. We're going to transform the section past Stonehenge, replacing the existing single carriageway and building a safer dual carriageway, including a two mile tunnel under the World Heritage Site. That will fix a road that right now doesn't work for drivers or anyone who lives, works or holidays in Wiltshire and the Southwest. Currently, it can take an hour or more to travel past Stonehenge, but in the future it'll take a fraction of that time, helping businesses and people to get from A to B, creating jobs and boosting the local economy. The tunnel itself will be built well away from the stones, in fact more than 200 metres. A specialist tunnelling machine will dig deep below the ground, creating two separate tunnels, one for each carriageway. When we're finished, the old road will be turned into a track for cyclists, horse riders and walkers, restoring Stonehenge to something like its original setting. To help create free-flowing traffic, we're also building a flyover above the Countess Roundabout, making it easier for local people to go about their daily lives. A new junction at Long Barrow, moving it west, away from the World Heritage Site. And a new bypass north of Winterbourne Stoke, with a viaduct over the River Till, taking away thousands of cars from locals' doorsteps every day. Neighbouring villages won't be used as rat runs to avoid queues on the A303, so once the new road is built, there'll be much more pleasant and peaceful places to live. Wildlife will benefit too. We'll be adding to what is already one of the world's largest areas of chalk grassland. And all sorts of animals will be able to move freely over the tunnel and across the four green bridges. After decades of heavy traffic and congestion, we're going to dramatically improve journey times and reconnect one of our most ancient landscapes. Over the next few years, we'll be working to make this a reality. We won't be closing the existing road, but we'll let you know what we're doing and when, keeping disruptions to a minimum and allowing you to plan your journeys. Find out more about the A303 Stonehenge project on our website and social media.